And hello, my fellow nerds out there. It's Rick and welcome back to Fran Bow. Uh, in the last part, we got the wizard shoes and honestly saw the most hilarious moment in the entire series. So now we have to go and find his wand, and it's supposed to be at the mecha at the mechanical thing by the bar. Okay, uh, let's change it to spring. Oh! It's right there! Okay, so I'm assuming we have to figure out this puzzle that's this. Yeah, what's this? Okay, so that does that. Uh, maybe this one? Ah! There we go! And okay, no, no, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. And then move it like this, and then this. Ta-da! There we go. Give me the wand. Oh great! This is the last task. Now I can go home. Hey. All right, change back to winter. Oh yeah, Valica. Nice. All right, into the into the wizard's cave we go. That was probably the easy. Honestly, that's probably the easiest puzzle I've had to do in this entire game. Hey, okay. the wand, great wizard! I got your wand. Here's your wand, sir wizard. Oh, magnificent, splendid! You did it. Really? But where are the stones? Can I borrow them? I can't lend you the stones. These stones are very, very special. What I can do is place the stones on the locks of the door, but, but you, you are the only one that can turn the key and actually open the door. Oh, I see. The king told me he would show me where the door is. Ah, then we should go and talk with him, don't you think? Hmm. Wait, I suspect that you can't return home looking like a tree. Oh, I almost forgot. Yes, you're right. Can you bring my human body back? Yes, I can. Oh, this is exciting! I haven't done this in hundreds of years! Let's make a human, yes? Give me your clothing. I need to smell it. Here, sir. My clothing. Mmm. Let me smell this. <laughs> this can work. We will make a human. Oh, this is... This is so exciting! Good. Now get... Now go to the center of the Star of Athirsta. Oh, we're about to do some magic shit. And think about your body, your head, your leg, your other leg, and your arm, both of them. Now, concentrate. Oh, oh, Shadaroom! <laughs> Randomly selected elements, find your path to your true essence. Become Fran the human. Now! Ooh! Oh, okay, that's actually disturbing! Self. Huh? Are you alright? Uh, what happened? Is it done? Uh, oh wow! Thank you so much, sir! You really are a great wizard! That Yes, that's my name. Great wizard. Because of the greatness. Hmm. I think we have to go now. Go to the king now, so he can show me the door. Yes, I'll I'll be right there. I have to finish something. I'll be there. Go now. He has to finish the rabbit sign still, I bet. <laughs> My friend, it's time to go home. We have to find the king. He must be in the castle. You're right, Mr. Midnight. I am so glad. I'm so glad I'm finally a human again. Oh, this this is great. Okay, if I remember right, the castle is this way. And then this way. Oh yeah, actually I should change it from winter. There we go. Spring. 
to the door we go. Okay. Okay, there we go. I try to find a click clickable ground. There you go. Oh god. Who is that? Everything is fine. It feels like heaven. Wait, isn't that what Fran said at the beginning of the game? What are you? Leave Mr. Midnight alone. But Mr. Midnight's right next to me, though. Is your head playing with you again? Can't you see yourself in the mirror? I'm not you. I'm not. Let Mr. Ni Midnight go. Now. We kill the traitors, because that's what he is, Fran. Don't you see? My kitty is not a traitor. I, he promised me to be by my side. He promised. As your mommy and daddy did. Who promised to take good care of you. Wake up, Fran. You're surrounded by traitors. Leave me alone. Leave my friend alone. I'm the only one you have, Fran. I'm the only one who's always by your side. Now let's get rid of this traitor, eh? What do you say? Let's be happy. Let's be so very, very happy together. Don't, don't, don't you do it. Motherfucker! Go away. Go away. It isn't me. It wasn't me. Ooh. Fran? What's wrong? Why are you crying? I'm crazy, sir. I'm totally crazy. The doctors are right. But you're not crazy. I'm very sorry that you feel that way. You should be happy now. You found the stones and you became a human again. That's very great indeed. My dear, let me wipe those tears. I don't want to hurt you, my dear. And I feel like I'm about to do it at any moment. You won't. I know that because you love me. Yes, Kitty, I do love you very much. Aww. That's so cute. Fran, remember what I told you. If you love, you are alive. And that's the only thing that matters. You will always find the power to fight those monsters in you. Now let's go and open the gate so you can go home. Yes, yes, let's do this. Oh, look, look at them. They're so cute. Oh, okay, we're going left apparently. Left. I really like his walking cycle, by the way. It's really nice. Here we are. Yes, but where's the door? Oh, right. I have to make it visible. But are you sure you want to go back? I'm sure, sir. All right. Here we go. The human must leave. Open the secret door to into her reality. Let the human return home. Ooh. Oh, wow. We are going home, Kitty. The wizard! Oh, 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 Zyre the king. Good day this. Good day to you. I brought the stones so this lovely creature can go home. Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. It will be strange to be far away from you all. Then don't leave. You can you can make a place to stay. A very magical place. Wizard, she has to leave. I received a message from the from one of the Valikas. And she is not ready. Oh, I, I see. What are you talking about? Ready for what? Come on, wizard, place the stones. We have no time to lose. But ready for what? You know, what the Valak has told you, about facing your truth. Uh, yes, I think I remember. Well, should I? Yes, go ahead, wizard, sir. Magic stones create the lock, and lock that only the human can break. Oh, magic stones! Well, now it's time for Fran to be the key. You are the only one that can open this now. Well, alright, let's see. Alright. Oh. 
I think I already have an idea of what we need to make. Oh, 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 it's one of those puzzles. Oh God, this is gonna take a while in it. Oh, it has to be a specific order. Okay, yeah, yeah, it's it's a specific order. Okay, it, it, it didn't take that long. I smell victory! Again! You did it, friend. You can go home now. I'm so excited. Oh, I wish I could leave you something so you can remember me. We won't forget you. You are a very special creature. Oh, I almost forgot. Palantris gave, gave me this for you. Oh? Is that a box? Oh, thank you. Tell Palantris that I wish I could help, help him with his wounds. I gave my aid patches to a girl in the hospital, but anyway, I'll tell him. And don't worry, Palantris is better now. Oh, oh, before you go, you must know. Before you return to your reality, you will go through the secret woods. The woods are kind of invisible passage between our realities. And you, and you may encounter terrible creatures that want to eat you. You... But you just... But just run. They're quite slow. And you're telling me this now? Huh. That sounds very scary. Don't worry. You'll do fine. <laughs> I hope so. Well, Mr. Midnight... Say goodbye. Let's go now. Goodbye, gentlemen. I had a great time. <laughs> I, I like you very much. Goodbye. And into the portal we go! Where we'll stop, nobody knows. Except for us, but... Okay, so we just have to run. Oh, Christ! What is that? Oh, no, wait. wait did, did I miss the jump? How did I miss the jump? Okay, okay, just need to time it with the cat. No! Ah, okay, I can't time it with the cat. I have to time it a little bit after Mr. Midnight. Mr. Midnight's faster than me, so... Yes! Jump! Okay! Whoop! Jump! 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 Oh! Go, 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 go! Jump! Come on! Come on! That thing is terrifying, I'm not gonna lie. Go! 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 Yes! Let's go! Oh my god, that that's horrifying. Chapter 4, part 1, my imaginary friend. Oh, do I have to... Okay, yeah, I have to click. <laughs> my goodness, the door opened. Wow, interesting. Come on, Mr. Midnight, let's find out where we are. Oh, there goes a- Oh, Fran, I hope we can find home soon. I'm starving. Mr. Midnight, look, I think we're on the other side of the bridge. Do you remember the one we tried to cross before we fell into the- We fell into it, Thursda? Yes, I remember. <clears throat> Great, let's keep going, Kitty. We have to be careful now. Ah, oh, these are my pills as well. But where are they going? Oh? Uh, oh, I, I see what they're doing. 
pills. Don't move. Ah, you want to show me the way back home? Wait, it says home. Home. I guess home is in is in that direction. Come here, pills. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh no, I shouldn't have touched the pills. Bad, friend. Bad, bad. Uh, what should I do now, Kitty? We're trapped forever and ever. Uh, no, we're not. Use the knife. Ha ha! Oh god, look at the cat's expression. <laughs> uh, who are you? Oh, it's you! Fran, you're already here. Well, I wasn't expecting you until 2.35. As I see it, you are not trapped anymore. Interesting. Anyway, let me introduce myself. I am Itward, your faithful friend. Itward? Do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. Yes, I'm the creature of the night. We've been playing together. I helped you get Mr. Midnight back, you see. Really? Huh. I, th I think I managed quite well to find my kitty on my own. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? No, it wasn't me. Me making the sisters mad. They believed it was me. You see, but that, but that's because they never looked into themselves. What do you mean by they never looked into themselves? They blamed me instead of facing the fact that, that their parents never loved them. But let's stop talking about the sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear friend? A long man with a top hat? <coughs> I always came by, by night and told you stories when you were just a little baby. I came to you after you imagined me. But I'm not imaginary, you see. I'm part of your reality. Did I imagine you? You look quite familiar, yes. I can't deny that. <clears throat> I, I exist because you exist. The, tru the truth is that you were able to imagine me because I already existed. Anyway, we don't have time to talk about this right now. Actually, I'm here to take you home. Follow me. Take me home? I can't let you do that. I don't know you. I won't hurt you. I'm not made out of darkness. I'm your friend. Hmm. Alright, you seem nice. I'll go with you, but I won't trust you yet. That's fine. Come on now. I have something to show you. Oh, you're a tall man! You're a tall skelly man! He's like twice her height! Okay, what well, you gotta show us? Oh. Behold, the Itward flying machine. What do you think? I love it. It has many buttons to push. Yes, with this gorgeous piece of machinery, I'll take you home. We'll fly as soon as I fix the details. Besides, it's not 235 yet. That sounds great, but what is it about 235, sir? I don't understand. It's when time becomes slower, and it gives us a chance to enter the ultra-reality. Inside the ultra-reality, we can travel wherever we want to go. Right now, we are standing on the endless limits of the second reality. But you are part of the third reality. Do you understand? Yes, I do understand. It sounds insane. But, sir, should I just wait until you're done fixing the machine? Wait! Of course not! You can help by getting water and fire berries. Alright? Alright, it's better to do something than nothing at all, I guess. Great! Here is my amazing handmade bucket of water. New bucket for water. I made it myself. Ooh! Ah, and the fire berries. Uh, you realize which berries to pick up because of, well, the fire. Alright, but sir, can I just ask, why do we. Do you need berries in the water? Ah, well, the berries are incredibly good fuel. They last many, many hours. The wet and the water is to get rid of the dirt. The Kamalas. Oh, Kamalas, I see. I hope they don't come around with the flying machine. We never know. 
but we do know that, that they don't like water, yes? Oh, darling, I almost forgot. Your medicine, you need it. Some things are still invisible to your eyes, you see. Here. Yes! I got my pills back! <clears throat> invisible to my eyes? Hmm, I see. Well, thank you. I was trying to catch these pills earlier, but the trap caught me first. Oh, yes, about that. I'm sorry. I needed to get your attention somehow. You could have just... I mean... I'm pretty sure a tall walking skeleton man with a top hat is enough attention grabbing as is. <laughs> you don't need to make a trap that that convoluted. <clears throat> it's okay, sir. I defeated the trap like in like in one second. <clears throat> Anyways, I'll go get the fireberries in the water. I'll be right back. Great, I'll be preparing the machine. Okay. Oh my god, look at him, he has a little wrench. <laughs> tink, tink. He's like an engineer, he's like engineer from Team Fortress 2. Okay, so... I'm guessing the water is somewhere around here. Alright, we haven't seen all this stuff with my pill, so let's take a pill and see what happens. Oh, hey, it's these guys again! Hello? You're the shiny insects that got stuck in the tree because of curiosity. We usually get stuck, yes. How do you know this? You're not one of us. I met some of your kind before. I helped them get free, get free from curiosity. Ah, that's very nice of you. Curiosity can lead us to unexpected situations. Yes, I think curiosity is a good thing, but are you stuck? Not at all. We were just trying to make our hair hair the longest hair ever. Wow, that sounds amazing. Good luck. I have to go now. Bye. Okay, what's to the left? Oh, gosh. Hell? Jesus. Oh, oh the berries are on fire. It has to be fire berries. Get out. Get out. Get out. You're trespassing on my territory. Huh? Excuse me, I thought you were dead. How can you possibly think that? You have no manners, young lady. I'm very sorry, but you seem to be rotten and bloody. Me? Rotten and bloody? I think you are misunderstanding the situation. What do you mean that by that, Mr. Moose? Mr. Moose? I'm not a moose. I'm a deedle worm. I'm a deadly... I'm a deadly worm. A... Excuse me? A deadly worm? No, no, not a deadly worm. A deadly worm! I don't go around killing creatures. I I just give back to the soil what creatures took from it and don't need any more. But I only see a talking moose. Where where are you? Oh that's what you are. Down here, creature. Can't you see me? Oh there you are. You're so tiny. Hello, my name is Fran. Hello, Fran. Can I ask you what why did you touch the moose in the first place? Normally, only scavengers would touch dead animals. Are you one? Of course not. I was trying to see if I can climb on it to reach the fireberries. I see. I think it's possible. The moose is still very sturdy and solid. But the fireberries are on fire. You could hurt yourself. Yes, I see the fire, but I have to make. I have to take them somehow. Good luck with that. Climb on now. I'll keep working. Thank you, sir. Very polite for a deadly worm. Okay, so do I have anything I can carry them in? I can't take the fireberries, they're on fire. Okay, let's go ahead and climb back down. Okay, let's go over here. Oh, oh so much hair and it's so shiny. I wonder what I wonder what it word looks like in the other in this version. Or in this That's not it word. Am I nu am I nutritious? I bet I am. Tasty. Ugh. No, I don't like thinking like that. Mm, delicious berries. Uh, we should, let's talk to it word. Maybe he knows something. Did you find the fighter berries in water already? 
We need them for the journey back home. Uh, how am I supposed to find water exactly? Um, hmm. Wait. Oh, it's down there. This is very odd. When we fell to a thirst there, there was no water. I wonder if we really fell. Maybe we fell upside down. Maybe the magic door into a thirst there was underwater. Pills? Ooh. Can I use? Oh no, I can't reach the water from here. Wait! I got it! I got it. Use the bucket with hair. I need help, please. Would you please allow me to tie this bucket to your beautiful hair? Tie a bucket to our hair? Why? That sounds insane. Oh, it's not insane at all. I need water from under the cliffs, but I can't reach it. I need to use your beautiful long hair as a rope. Please help me. Alright, we'll help you. Tie the bucket real tight. Oh, thank you. You're very nice. Fill up the whole bucket, please. Ooh. The bucket is now full of water. Aw, oh, thank you, shiny insects. I have to go now. I have to get home. Home is somewhere. We all wish to belong. But does home belong somewhere? What? I'm sorry. I didn't really understand the question. It was a rhetorical question. I just wanted to say that you were... You are your own home. Welcome yourself inside. You may... You will find many doors to open. Oh, that sounds mysterious and beautiful. I'll try to do that some other time. Bye. Okay, so we got the water. Wait, maybe we can use the water on the fireberries. Get out, scavengers. It's me, sir. Can I climb the moose again? Go ahead. <laughs> okay. Okay, so maybe we can use this on here. The fire is gone. I can take the berries now. I can't just pull them off of my hands. They're firmly attached. Oh, use a knife then. Chink. There we go. The fire berries, they're not on fire anymore. There we go. Wait, I wonder. I'm curious. Use it on the Kamala? This won't work, huh? Okay, fine then. Alright. Did you find... Okay, yes, I, I found them already. Uh... Sorry, what? Here's the bucket of full of water. I got help from the shiny insects. You mean the... Oh, you mean the Luciferns. They are they are nice, yes, but only when you see them in this reality. They're very dangerous if you ever see them in the fifth reality. They could burn you. Wow, burn me? Well, I haven't been to the fifth reality yet. I don't recommend it. What's reasonable there? There may be the wor worst you'll ever experience. Oh, I forgot to thank you for the water. Thank you, friend. <laughs> And we also got the fireberries. So I bought the fireberries, but they're not on fire anymore. Magnificent! They will do just fine. Thank you very much, my darling. Ah, Fran, it's 2.34. The journey will begin. Will begin. Let's go inside the machine. Cool. Uh, how does he fit into that tiny door frame? Come on, kitty! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that's cool! It's 2.36. We have, a, we have a great possibility of reaching the target in good condition. We'll soon be on our way to the third reality. Are you excited, Fran? Maybe I would be excited if I would understand more about the realities. You'll soon understand. 
The answers are not easy to recognize. Huh, that sounds strange to me, sir. Time goes as it has to, in order for you to be alive. If all- if it all happened now, you'll probably explode. Are you telling me that the answers I'm looking for will- will come to me when they want? Not exactly. You know what? I'd rather say... Through time, you have to explore and experience to understand. This means the answers will come to you when you find them. Not when others tell you how or where to find them. Ah, uh, I see. Well, I'm excited now. You woke up my curiousness. That's the best thing you could do for yourself. Be curious, and you'll always be amazed. But now, friend, we have to get things done. Talking won't, won't take you home. What things, sir? The machine needs some maintenance. I think you could do incredible work. Here are the fireberries and the water you gathered before. Okay. You'll need them to get the water pump working again and the fuel mixed. You'll find all the information you need when you enter the room to the left. But feel free to enter any room you wish. I'll be quite busy fixing the automatic driver. But if you have something to ask, I'll be here. Hmm, but I've never done anything like this before. before. That makes it more exciting. Have fun, my darling. Alright, I'll go now. Uh, can we put on music? Mm, this music makes you think of forks. If you guys can't hear the music, you can turn the volume up if you want. Right, Maybe I should push the button. Oh. Push the button. Oh, hey! It's that thing! Come back! <laughs> this reality view ultra reality view What's this I cannot read this at all this looks like some kind of water pump what do you have inside little bottle hmm 90J, 9JM, N166. Hmm. Wait, is that the process I have to do? PL33. 2 pf AFM There's no AFM though Um R15 A18 Hmm. Oh, wait, I have matches. There we go. So, like that? Wait, is it still the same? Yeah, okay, it stays that way until I can figure it out. It's nice to show if something's working. Pencil? What's this? Oh! Okay, I think I have an idea. No, um...
Don't just use this. Won't even try that. Okay. Wait, what if I... Okay, let's go to this version. Oh, God, what are you? Seconds and minutes and hours and days. Tick tock, tick tock. I forgot to understand you. I forgot, I forgot to give myself some love. Hmm. Oh, I drag it. I feel so stupid. Click and drag. So No, over here. Okay, wait a second. Um, okay, wait, let me try to figure this out. Okay, so I thought I'd probably uh, try it later. Um, this, try to figure the thing out later. I, I actually had to look up a guide. There's actually an achievement I can get here. So you press, and there's apparently this little mini game thing. Uh, press start, get ready. Oh, okay, 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 I get it, I get it, I get it. There we go. Oh, it, it, it's literally Galaga. There we go. Ah, no. Come on. Attack of the Easter Egg? Wait, Easter Egg? Wait, what? Shoot ahead of it. Shoot ahead of it. Yeah, there's that's the strategy. Oh, I, I get it. Attack of the Easter Egg. Because this is an Easter Egg in a game. It's a game within a game. Now, like I've seen that Easter Egg before. Unexpected behavior from, from the ItWork computer machine database has been found. It ItWork has been shut down. Easter egg allowed. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> oh, oh my oh, that's cool. Okay, so that that was the there was actually an achievement there that I wanted to get. I I heard about the achievement being there. And hopefully I got it. I don't know if Steam actually tracks my achievements for this one. Okay, uh, let me go back in here. Is there a way to reset this? Hmm. Wait, is it? Maybe I can use the fire berries in one of these? Uh. Oh! There we go! 
Okay. Uh, let's try you here. Wait, and that one's orange, so... You have to be orange? And then your R15? No. 2PF? No. A18? No, that's this again. N61? Or N M166? This? Uh, maybe you have to be, no, this? Oh wait, maybe you're this one? Be this. <clears throat> Here. Uh, let's try. I was never really that good in science class, honestly. And then you go here. Oh! I didn't know I could actually use these! Use with... Uh, no. Use with this one? No. Use with... This one? No. Hmm. Uh, can I probably fill this out? I can! I think I do have the A AFM. It's the fireberries. Hmm. Wait, maybe... Maybe use this here. Wait, do I have to put water in these? No. Wait, maybe there's something around here we can use. water goes in there oh so if we go over here the water in here okay let's close that up no it seems to be damaged I don't think we have anything to fix this Let's examine it. Maybe there's a secret code or something. Hmm. Okay, let's let's go explore the other room. Also, oh, the the little cat, come back. All right. This. I wonder what kind of thing this machine can.
I wonder if it would really does love black cats. Hmm. Okay, wait, let's take let's take a look at the other reality. Oh, it's the sisters! Are you the are you here to kill Itwood? Oh little key, I wonder what this is for. Okay, let's go in here. Oh god! Why does Itward look like that? Itward? Okay, that's creepy. Okay, let's see. Um, door's closed. Maybe we can open it later. Alright, let's go back in here. Wait, there's something right here. That definitely wasn't there before. Oh, is this some sort of connector? Is it a missing part? Oh, wait a second. Go back here. Yes! That's what that... So that... So this is for that. So now I can probably connect the other two, right? Oh! Okay, maybe you go here? Yeah! I'm missing something, apparently. Okay, maybe you go here? You go here. Wait, I did put you in there, right? Okay, I'm pretty sure I did. So, um, what? Maybe no, because that only changes that. And I, I think I have. I think this has to be that. No. Am I missing something here? I'm definitely missing something here. Oh! There's something over here! It was another green hose? Are you kidding? Use. Yes, there we go. Yeah, we got it. We did a thing. We actually did a thing. Okay, um, let's look at this one. Okay. 
But we need something to fix that. Miss Edward doesn't know about hygiene. Okay. Wait, maybe this up here? What's this? Oh? Is this what the key is for? Let's see what happens. Oh! <coughs> In a world made of darkness and light, two little sisters try to steal each other's charm, but none of, but none of the sides could decide. What if they were just uh, was just right? Mia was angry and Clara was sad. And this was because they both were mad. Oh, insane little girls. Inside of their minds. <coughs> Edward, the creature of the night. <coughs> he came he came always around in dreams of, or reality, teaching the girls of splendor and duality. But they couldn't understand. <clears throat> Itward was a friend. Itward was the link between darkness and light. He was gray. But Clara and Mia one day decided to get rid of Itward once and for all. Die, creature of the night, die, they said. But they killed each other instead. Dead and gone. The sisters kept complaining about each other. <clears throat> it's all your fault, Clara. It's all your fault, Mia. Then Edward came to visit for the last time, and he said, You are both trapped. You are both trapped in the world of disconnections. But I'll give you a chance. The world has been mean to you. <clears throat> they sewed their bodies, they sewed your bodies together to prove that they could. They gave you a mirror to compare yourselves. I'll give you nothing but what you already have. And, and just one tiny little chance to understand the purpose of life. But the clock is ticking. You have until the day a black cat goes missing and the well's magic door is unlocked. The end. Oh, and that's what hap and that's what happened to f that's when uh Fran Bo started, right? So that was the truth behind Clara and Mia. Looks like a mathematical problem. So Clara and Mia were experimented on by humans and it were tried to help them. But are we sure that's the actual story? I sense a, I sense a theory coming on, but for now, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please leave a like, comment what you think, share this video with your friends, and be sure to subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss a single notification. I'll see all of you in the next video. Goodbye. You say you want to try, but you know.